Hello and welcome back to the channel Week 4 of Manchester Marathon training How did we get there? So, you joined me on Friday this week and I'm out doing a tempo session So it's like 3 times 1200 metres It's like 3 quarters of a mile um, And then so you go So it's 7 minute miles for that and then slow it down for the last quarter of a mile 0.25 um, about eight and a half minute mile pace Wow It's going to be epic So I'm just doing a warm up just now But I'll just do a wee quick recap on how the weeks went so far So it's deload week here as prescribed by runner coach Again if you're not using runner coach then head over give it a try using code one with Steven Get your two weeks free So deload week Monday was supposed to be seven and a half miles, I've done six with Grant, just nice easy cruisy miles Tuesday, kids are off school, was due a gas service and stuff I was night shift, I actually only managed to get my run in at like five o'clock at night an hour before I went to work and it was the intervals I decided to do the intervals were really hard, um, six minute ten Per mile, like sort of a pace per rep, and it was 4 3 2 1. Again, absolutely solid, but I loved it. See the feeling after it, I wasn't as tired anymore going to work. Wednesday, I took it as a rest day, and yesterday, I got some nice easy miles in on the treadmill as an easy run. Um, but done something really stupid. So I dropped the car off and walked home with a little Huntley boy If you've seen the reels you'll see him What a wee trooper he is But I ended up doing like 3 mile walk yesterday And you know I can actually feel it in my legs today They're quite tight from that walk Which was really surprising, I was very very surprised About how they felt So I, That has been my week so far Again, just trying to fit these sessions in when I can because life does get in the road and you'll be happy to know that I feel much better this week So, so weird, I couldn't believe last week how ironic it was telling you guys like how can you have one bad week and one good week and it was an absolute shock at the run If you haven't seen that video then I'll just post a wee link above and you can check last week's training run out on there so I again feeling a whole lot better and just generally feeling motivated to get this done today so warm ups just about finished and we'll get cracking into these reps right let's go 7 minute mile pace 3 quarters of a mile Let's go So if any of you that know me and know this road This is where I tend to do all my flats so, And um, just along the cycle lanes here And along the pavements Mostly where I do my, my speed sessions I meant to say there because Again it's just nice and flat And it just provides the perfect place to run when it's not school team. So let's go and get this run done. Here we go. On the easy quarter of a mile, so that's two 1200s done with an easy 400, you could say, after each 1200. So, oh, I'm definitely overdressed for the occasion, 
Oh man, Whew. this last one is going to be hard work and then we go into quarter of a mile, easy again, 400s and then one kilometer cool down so I'll get this next rep done and then I'll catch up with you just shortly after that in the cool down kilometer, let's go. So, tempo run done, I'll just pop it up here, um, just on the cool down just now, so just one comma cool down. Let's get my rear end moving then, eh, since it's a cool down, not a walk down. Um, now nah, I'll see these, so this will be sort of run walk just to try and cool down, it's bloody roasting by the way, never even thought that today, wearing these gloves as well, so. Hi, that was the run. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sit here and stand here and say that was easy because it wasn't. It was definitely pushing me at my threshold. So I don't know if it's just the weather or that, but it's fine. Um, very strong, confident run, and I enjoyed it. Like, see, just knowing that you've got only three sets or two to do, it makes it that wee bit more sort of mentally fine rather than not really having a plan in your head so I just want to take this opportunity to thank everybody for continuing to watch the videos continue to support the channel and just continue to be, uh, to be absolutely inspirational and epic because when I see you, every one of you out there who comment, who are on my Instagram um, I do try and find you so if you're thinking about subscribing and you are a public subscriber I definitely will search you up if your name comes up saying that you have subscribed to the channel Wow, sweaty eyes so with that being said I'm going to end this week's vlog there a good solid week of running fitting life in when I can and just generally trying to juggle everything <laughs> kids, life, dog Everything, it's hard work isn't it? And as well, I've got a full time job too so you can imagine, like all of you who's watching this it is relatable, it is and it can be done like I'm doing just now so thanks again everybody for tuning in and I'll see you in week 5 oh my god there's only like 7 weeks to the Manchester Marathon Ah! how did that even happen? So, let's go get this run done and get some lunch. Let's go.